so I just arrived at the airport. It is currently, just turn on my phone, 5.51 and I am exhausted. I just got through customs and everything, now I'm waiting for my flight to board so I can go wait over there. Flying to the Gold Coast, so a 3 hour, 20 minute flight and Ainsley is picking me up on the other side. So this is what Auckland Airport looks like. Sorry if I sound half asleep, I am. And I'm really hungry but I hate paying the amount of money that they ask for food here so I'm just going to wait till I arrive in Australia probably. Just arrived at the Gold Coast and Ainsley picked me up from the airport and I'm at her place now and it's really stuffy and cloudy so not the most amazing weather but I'm so happy to be off that flight. I kept falling asleep and like my neck is so weird. Ainsley just gave me my bra. This is what we paid how much for? It's like 70 something dollars. 70, that's Australian that's dollars. Australian. It's so it's like, like 19 New Zealand. Yeah, 90 New Zealand dollars for this ugly ass bra that we've got to wear for like two months after surgery. And it's got like this ugly little embroidered flower even. I mean, what a rip off. But we bought some sports bras as well off NZ Sale, which I think are going to be better than this, and they cost like $20 each. So me and Ainsley are just driving into the Gold Coast now. Is that what you call it? Yeah, we're on the Gold Coast. <laughs> we're on the Gold Coast. Where are we going? Um, Pacific Bed, Broad Beach. Broad Beach. <laughs> we'll just take you along. So we don't leave, what's today? It's today Wednesday. Wednesday. Yeah. So we don't leave until Friday afternoon, I think. So yeah. we've still got all of today and all of tomorrow and then pretty much Friday the next morning. day as well. Yeah, Yeah, we can get it up at 11 o'clock on Friday. Oh yeah, so we've just got the morning on Friday, so. We're gonna go buy some last minute supplies, like some baby wipes and some numbing cream because both of us are terrified of needles and we wanna numb everything beforehand so we can't really feel it or anything. And some snacks and just stuff like that. In Australia, they have their sushis in rolls <laughs> instead of pieces. She's laughing at me. <laughs> I told her I was going to vlog it. Australian. Hmm? Australia is strange. Yeah, Australia is really weird. <laughs> It is four o'clock here and if I was at home like in New Zealand it's seven o'clock but I am so freaking tired I mean I woke up at 4 30 I'm dying right now we've just been looking at boobs all day online like on youtubers videos like before and afters and their experiences and how they sleep and things like that and I think my vlogs are gonna help you guys like I've had a lot of people say that you want to see them because obviously other people are planning the same thing as I'm going through so I've got a good idea of what to talk about because I found a few things that other people haven't really covered so I'm going to try it with as thorough as possible. I'm so like shatterbrained, like headachey and just don't even know what's going on and like I had a scone before and I feel like it was dinner because like usually I'd have eaten like an hour ago but it's only four o'clock here so this will be interesting. <music> It's day two now, I just did my makeup and I put a highlight on and it's really shimmery and it makes my eyes look really weird so that was a fail. But today we're going to go to a chocolate cafe, Ainsley wants to take me and we're just buying all the rest of the stuff like we forgot to buy and set repellent and like little travel bottles and stuff for like shampoo and everything so we're doing that and I had the most weird sleep last night, I had jet lag, like I woke up at 11 o'clock and then woke up like every hour after that like in Australia. We're only three hours behind New Zealand but I still just like was screwed up. I think it's because I woke up so early yesterday morning. Like my body is just screwed up. So hopefully by the time I get to Thailand and have my surgery 
I'll just sleep the whole time because I'll be like jet lagged and it'll be good. We leave for surgery tomorrow morning ish. I hope you can actually see me. I should probably be on this back. We leave tomorrow morning to go to the airport and then we leave in like the afternoon slash night and then we arrive in Thailand at like midnight I think. And it was amazing. It was my first chocolate cafe experience. Yeah, we're and I feel, yeah, I feel like we're gonna spew it out. Like we both feel. How, how's it? Like, like a so recent. Like I think I want to go to bed and die. <laughs> go curl up in bed and just sleep for the rest of the day. Now and we're just waiting for our flights in an hour and we're going to Thailand. It's about how many hours? Nine hours, I think. Nine hours and then two hours stopover and then, and then another hour flight. And we get there at like midnight in Thailand. Then we go to the doctor tomorrow morning. So. And now we have to wait for two hours. That flight was eight hours long and we got like 15 minutes of sleep. Did you know a chick covered Shannon's TV screen with her hair? Yeah. She went like this over the seat and covered the fucking TV screen. You should have pulled it. You should have cut it. We're walking on this zoomy thing. It makes us feel like we're walking really, really quickly. And we're all really delirious and tired now. Yeah, we're all like this. <laughs> I finally got here and it's 1am and like I had the worst experience but I'll just cover it tomorrow because we're going to sleep. <laughs> 